Well, sees everybody already knows what it is. The only One Piece game that actually looks like it's worth playing. So I'm not gonna lie, all these other One Piece games we've gotten, talking about Blocks Rich, GPO, all the other ones, Pixel Piece. Not gonna lie, they are, they're not really they're not really like games you want to like devote a shit ton of time into unless you have nothing else to do and you want to waste your life away. It's really that simple. Other the games are like literally just bandit beaters. It's an RPG game. Most of them include some sort of leveling system with different ways to achieve said levels. It's a pretty important part of RPG games. So how is it in this game? Garbage. Leveling is a major thing that this game needs to improve on, I believe. It's so painfully long and tedious that it's probably a pretty big reason there are so many players in this game. GPO at least has the battle royale. Battle royale is pretty fun, I can't lie. Honestly, I never played Pixel Piece. This shit looked like ass. One Piece New Dreams. I still hate Swift DFT for even hyping me up for that game. I logged into that shit and it was the worst game. I like they had to try to make those graphics that bad. But anyway, Real Seas, I'm not gonna lie, it's looking worrying for Real Seas because I don't know if this shit's ever gonna I don't know if my, I, I think my grandkids might not be able to to play real seas bro at this point i don't even know what's up i'm actually worried that this game is not gonna drop for like a good amount of time because i want this shit now i'm watching one piece and i want it now bro i want to be i want to be the damn big luffy in the real seas just whacking shit i want to be whacking my shit in real seas and i'm not just saying it's not gonna come out for like no reason like i literally think this shit's gonna like take a while to come out now one of the main things obviously the devs twitter i had to go make a damn twitter to get all this shit he said that he wants the game to be perfect like straight perfect he wants nothing about he wants it to be the best game ever dropped and uh, i don't know if you guys know but uh there's nothing perfect in the world so if we went off that assumption this shit's never coming out but i think they are putting like their damn pouring their soul and shit into this game and i really hope it doesn't end up like shadow life because i do not want to see the star platinum in uh real seas because he was not in one piece and also there's just a lot of content in real seas as well of course all these other one piece games there's just like no con like there's no i don't even know what to like compare it to because there's no other one piece games that have really done shit like real seas is trying to do they're trying to do hella boss fights mounts custom ships custom ship battles crews all this shit and i just haven't seen it with any other one piece game it's not even like dick sucking glazing dick riding none of that like they are literally just going above and beyond for all this i'm pretty sure every fruit has some type of oh like sick ass cutscene a lot of them have modes transformations shit like that multiple transformations it literally just like they're cooking a lot and every time they release a trailer or anything of the sort almost every time they've done it they said that like trailer puts makes the other one completely outdated and the game is completely different from the last trailer they've said that twice i'm pretty sure for the trailers they've dropped which is like making me think like every time they like think of a new idea or I think it's some way to better it. They just kind of scrap, not really scrap, but like they put all the other stuff they've done behind and put in the new stuff so they can remake everything better to their like own liking with the new idea. I think they're just, I think they're in a constant loop of trying to make the perfect game. And I'm not complaining really. I mean, I'd like to see it come out soon, but I mean, hey, you can't rush perfection as they say. And as far as I know, they haven't even like teased, hinted, or even gave it anything about a release date at all. Like I haven't seen anything about a release date for Real Seas except for me just making stuff up or other people might just making stuff up. Like no. Nobody, like they have not said anything about a official release date for real seas not even when they plan to have it done by so as far as we know this damn game could come out in damn 10 years like literally your children's children could be rocking with this game i don't, I don't know how you're having children's children in 10 years but hey you get the point dude there's literally just no nothing about when real seas is gonna drop and they did say that some of these devs been slacking a little bit and they're delaying like not really delaying but they're delaying the sneaks and then it's getting a little pissy with the devs not locking in so hey that definitely does not help the release date that definitely does not help this game come faster the devs playing with the dicks instead of doing real c's content that does not help with the development as you can imagine but yeah i'm hyped for real c's i wasn't really caring about it too much and i started watching one piece and i'm just i can't wait for the drop I can, it looks like there's gonna be so much content it looks like it's gonna be a fun little experience because there's gonna be a lot of shit i just hope it doesn't really turn out like shindo life because i'm not gonna lie shindo life became like a damn chore to even like comprehend what was going on they had so much shit in there but yeah besides that go down there like and subscribe if i make another real c's video you're in because if i make another one it's just gonna be that it's delayed again and i hope that doesn't happen i hope my next real c's video is that shit saying oh my god real c's the release date confirmed